Okay, so I'm going to show you a bug and quite possibly a security issue that I found in the iPhone 3.0 software. Um, it has to do with um, searching through your mail messages, but this this allows you to find messages that you think you have completely deleted from your iPod or iPhone. Um, I'm running an iPod Touch second generation with software 3.0 and to demonstrate I've sent myself an email to an account, a POP account, a POP account. And so here's the email. I made the the subject line A, B, B, C, C, so it'd be easier to search for. But what I'm going to do th now is go ahead and delete it from the inbox. And if we go back and delete it from the trash, it should be completely gone, right? Well, let's go back here. Go back to the home screen. And if we search here, it finds the message. Now it comes up twice and if I click one of them what it's first going to do is launch mail but it's going to crash. It'll crash and send me back to the home screen. But if you go back there's the crash, we go back and we tap it again it's going to open the message. Now one of these is going to say the message cannot be displayed blah 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 and it says you've got this message is only partially downloaded. If you click that, nothing's going to happen. You can notice we have um, message one of zero, which is obviously a mistake because it's not there. I click the back, there's nothing in the trash. Now if I go back and try the second one, first time I do it, it's going to crash after about five to ten seconds. Send me back to the home screen just like the other one. But if we tap it again, it goes in, just like last time, one of zero. This time it's showing it's in my inbox, and it also shows the actual message with nothing to be downloaded. But the problem is, there's nothing there. It's not in my inbox, it's not anywhere. Now this is a pop account, I'll show you that right now. That one was Matt and Bark. Go to there. Go to Matt and Bark, and you can see that this is a pop account. So the message is still on the server, right? And maybe that's why it's trying to search. Search, maybe it's reaching back at the server for some reason. But over on my Mac, you can see I've used the mail feature that shows all the messages on my server. There's the only one, the AABBCC one. Let's remove that from the server. Okay, so it's gone from the server. Go back here, and we'll try to search for it again. Clear it out. Oh, and it's still there. Since we did a new search, it's going to crash this time again. And then if we go back into it, it'll show me the message. and there it is. So obviously this could be a major security issue if you think you deleted something from your iPod but it's really not deleted. You can still search through mes messages that were deleted. And this isn't messages that are just recent. I found some messages that are over three or four months old. Here's one I think I sent quite a few months ago crash the first time go back tap it again you can see this one was sent in June and obviously as I showed you there's nothing still on the server so these messages are still on the iPod somewhere even after you delete them but you can't find them without searching for them. Like I said, this is a, a security issue, a bug, 
and hopefully hopefully Apple will fix it in some later releases.